me go say hello. What are we going to name our sheep? Well, we have four, so think of four really good names. Maybe, like, theme it. Like, uh, can you think of a... Are there four people that you really like who are in a group or something where they all have... The Fantastic Four? That it could be. I mean, those sheep are going to reproduce. They're going to produce a fantastic fifth at some point, I'm sure. Oh, shit. The Silver Surfer. This this is Ben. The, the, you know, the guy that looks like The Rock. Is that his name? Like the boulder? Be yeah, Ben. Ben the sheep. I always thought his name was Golem Boy. Golem... Well, we can call this sheep Golem Boy. All right. Then there's Candleman. Candleman. That's the fire dude. Then there's... Candleman? Yeah, really? Candleman. That sounds like a Mega Man bad guy. Well... <laughs> it does, actually, yeah. But... Candleman. Not quite as good. Did it, did it, did it, did it, did it, did it. Oh, fuck. I love Mega Man. Me too. This is Inviso Bitch. I also like Manga Man. Do you remember Inviso Bitch from the Fantastic Four? Um, Vaguely. Yeah, she wasn't in it much because most of the time she was invisible. It's been a long time since I watched the Fantastic Four, so... Oh, shit. <laughs> she was invisible the whole time. <laughs> yeah. You didn't know she was there, but she was there, trust me. She had no lines, but there was they hired an actress. Well, she didn't want to break her cover. No, yeah, exactly. Yeah, she was incognito the whole time. Yeah. And the last member of the Fantastic Four is, uh, of course, Stretch Armstrong. Of course. Have you ever pulled With Stretch Armstrong? Really, really pulled him until he breaks? Not Stretch Armstrong, but my um, my son got like a, like a Stretch Armstrong style Scooby-Doo for Christmas last year. Yeah. And um, he pulled him so hard that he's, he broke. Oh, no. Did, did the... Did he, did... <laughs> So what yeah, happens one of, is when you pull like, him One of so his hard. arms came off and it was like... In the inside, there's this black goo. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's really, it was really messy. It's really traumatic because the kids think they've killed Scooby-Doo or Stretch Armstrong. And well, we black... made sure to hammer the point home. We're like, yeah, that's it. Christmas is canceled next year. You killed Scooby-Doo. And he was really crying a lot. Oh, shit. Like, We're like well, maybe you shouldn't have stretched him so hard. You know? Spilling out. Yeah, he stretched thin as it is. Just a, a reasonable amount of stretching is fine, but you, you took it too far. And now look what you've done. Yeah. Man, he was crying a lot. I was crying. My wife was crying. Scooby-Doo was... Our baby was crying as well. Scooby-Doo was... Bleeding. Inconsolable. Yeah. Writhing around, bleeding. It's oh, good, man. though. I mean, he's learned a couple of lessons. One, Scooby-Doo. Two, Christmas. Three... Yeah. He won't overstretch at the gym now either, because... That's right, because, like, you don't want that to... Man, imagine that happening to one of your hamstrings. Fuck. Yeah, just off, you know, I've, see, I've seen people push it too far at the gym. Yeah. And they're stretching, and uh, they stretch their arm off. Yeah. It happens. It's a, it's a real concern, especially if you're listening to, like, some really red-hot banging techno as well, and you're not really paying attention. The adrenaline's flowing. You're like, it's, just going to stretch it a little bit further and all of a sudden, boom. It's real common. You know, you're there rowing and suddenly like an arm flies across your field of vision. Yeah. Because somebody just went, 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 went ham. Too hard and ham on the rowing. Yeah. That's one thing I've never done before. I've never gone to the gym and used the rowing machine. Really? Because I always thought it makes you look a bit crazy. Yeah. It's like, um, like rowing a boat. You know, right. like at the Olympics, they do like, and you know, Oxford and Cambridge, they do rowing. Uh-huh. It's like that. And you can get machines that have, like, the whole boat. Right. And, and the four people. Okay. Uh, but they're all robots, of course. Of course. And the guy at the back, who's really short. Yeah. Like a, a, kind of like a Joe Pesci kind of guy. Is that the guy that bangs on the drum to, like, keep the tempo going? Yeah, he bangs on the drum right. and shouts abuse at you. And if you don't keep up with the rest of the team, he ass blasts you. But wait, the kind of abuse that he shouts at you, is it like sort of like Jason and the Argonauts era abuse? Like, because that's what they used to do as well, right? Yeah. On those slave ships. Roll! Roll, you, Roll fuck. you pussies! But it's in Joe Pesci's accent as well, so... Right. <laughs> so it's like just a really surreal experience altogether. Yeah, and so it's really tempting to laugh at him, but if you laugh at him, he, he gets very offended and... That's a big no-no. Yeah, Nobody no. laughs at Roboat Joe. <laughs> Robo, Robo What's his Joe. name? Robo does, Joe Pesci. Does he have like a title or is it just a... 
Oh, he's you the co coxswain. All oh, right, okay. So that's, that's like the, the official term for him. Yeah, yeah. He's official the co coxswain. Term for somebody who bangs the drum in a boat. Is a coxswain. Nice. Hey, so look at the uh, field that we sowed with um, canola is, is sprouting. Shit, is that the light green one? Yeah. See it? If I, can the I run over the canola? Yeah, the one that you're ruining right now, yeah. No, it doesn't ruin it, does it? No, no, it doesn't. No, okay. Ooh. So that one's uh, on its way to full growth. Yeah, yeah. I'm putting some grass in this field. Yeah. Sowing some grass seeds. So nice. once this grass is up, we'll, um, we'll cut it all up. We'll tether it. And we'll go feed the sheep. So, like, if you press escape now and you go yeah. into... Um, Scroll the way over to animals. Animals. Yeah. See, now we've got like oh. four sheep. They're 10% productive. They're going to reproduce in 2,399 hours. Yeah. They've made no wool, but they're clean and they've got enough water to see them through. So Sweet. now once we add some hay and grass into their um, feeding trough, their uh, production rate will go up to like 100%. They'll Shit. start producing some wool and they will... Start breeding as well. Um, oh, reproduction so, yeah. rate. 2,400 hours. Oh, I know, but nice. that'll come down. That'll come down to like something more like 24 hours or whatever. So every day we'll get like a new sheep, bonus sheep on top. And then what we're going to do is with all the fields, we're going to harvest them all up, sell the stuff, make some more money for sheep mm. uh, and all the equipment that we need for the sheep. Mm -hmm. And then boom. We'll be millionaires before Christmas. Sheep lords. And that's when we move on to pigs, right? Pigs? Well, yeah. After we've sort of made a ton of money, then we can just um, brute force pigs. Because I think what we're, we'll do is we'll just... We'll aim to buy like 75 pigs in one go. Whoa. Get them reproducing like crazy. And then what we'll do is we'll keep like a contingent of 75 pigs as like our breeders. Ah. And then we'll sell the babies for big bucks. Holy shit. The people, this is, is how farming works, man. We're, we're is there a big market for baby pigs? Hell yeah. Oh, shit. Well, I saw babe, yeah. I suppose, and I guess everybody else did too. Everybody wants a piece of that ass, so that's what we're going to be selling. What a babe. What a true babe. Yeah, so, so, so far, so good. We're profitable. We've spent some money, though. We've done some investing. We have done some, a little bit of investing. Yeah. Um, in, in the shape of we bought the water tanker. Uh, we also bought this. Have you seen my tractor with the uh, front loader and the and the bucket on the front? No. Can I change to it? No, because I'm in it. Or are you in it? I'm but in the lizard. Come in, come in. Maybe go in the pickup truck and zoom yeah. over here and check it out. I'm zooming. Holy shit, this thing's quick. You got to work all day and all night in this game, though. There's no time to rest. Oh, yeah. I like a real farmer, though. Because the Grim Reaper is just around the corner. Especially, and yeah. by the Grim Reaper, I mean the financial Grim Reaper. Like bankruptcy is a is a real thing. So Michael go. Yeah. So you got to make sure that you're um, always making making the the mad dollars. Is he like um, the Grim Reaper in Bill and Ted's Bogus Journey? Kinda, yeah. So if you are low on money, you can challenge him to games. To yeah, you gamble with him. All oh, right. You do like a fifty fifty with him. Say, oh. like, what are the odds that your mom is going to get hit by a car today? And yeah. it's like a 50-50. So you can put money on your mom. Bet against him. Through. And you get another chance, yeah. Shit, nice. Double yeah. up, double or nothing. Double or nothing, yeah. It's just like playing... It's like life is like a roulette table. What's the forfeit if you go bankrupt? What does the Reaper do? I think he takes your soul down into the depths of hell. Yeah. And um, so got El Chupacabra himself feasts on it for eternity yeah do they have any water down in hell no they don't need any because it's not really a place it's like a state of mind oh, so shit. um yeah hell. i know it's like next level shit but yeah basically if the grim reaper harvests your soul you're gonna be like what's your worst what's are you like claustrophobic like would you be scared of dying like in an avalanche say no. or no 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 okay you'd be fine with that what's yeah, your yeah. what's like your worst fear Clowns. Okay. So when, if the Grim Reaper comes and he harvests your soul and El Chupacabra feasts on it, yeah, you can bet your ass you're going to be spending an eternity with a bunch of clowns. Um, Shit. Well, honestly, that sounds like the my day clown music, they're going to... Yeah, I know. But these are like uh, circus clowns. Proper cir 
like the terrifying ones. They're going to have the music. They're going to be doing balloon tricks for you. You're going to be like screaming and crying the whole time because you're petrified of Again, them. Again, sounds like my day to day. And all this in a room that you can never leave. Like uh, you can't, you're not allowed to leave this room. So it's like a real hell. I think I've Earth. just come to a revelation. What? My life is hell. I am, I am in hell. <laughs> I'm, I'm surrounded by clowns. Duncan does balloons all day. Does he? Uh, yeah, yeah. Wow. You know, like, you know, you can get like laughing gas and put uh-huh. it in a balloon and it's, <laughs> it's a thing. Yeah. So yeah, balloons. So he huffs yeah. them balloons all day. Yeah, but I think he's gas. doing it wrong because when he, when he comes out of it, his voice is just really high pitched. Right, yeah. It's like a side effect of not, not huffing balloons properly. Yeah, no, no. It's, he needs to learn how to huff. huff and so, puff. So, you, so you as a person feel right now that you could potentially be in hell? I think so, yeah. Trapped in a room I can't get out of, full of clowns, I'm, doing balloons. Uh, yeah. I mean, my worst fear is getting addicted to a farming simulator computer game. Yeah? Here I am. Do you think you're there? Do you think? Unable to put it down. So maybe I'm also in hell. It's okay. This, I'll help you through it. I'm also These things here. I think about so so very often. It's it's really frightening. It's okay. I'm here with you, buddy. We're riding <laughs> convoy. We're riding convoy now. Here. I like gonna- this. Uh, I like how you. I like how you're here for moral support because there's there's no other jobs to be done on the farm right now. When none, I say that, literally there isn't. All. Actually, we're we're on top of everything. We're waiting for fields to uh, Shit, to, yeah. to grow so we can harvest them up. You know what time it is then? Miller time. It's time for a hoedown. Oh shit! No, you know what time it is, Shin? <laughs> what? It's time for an ass blast, bitch. Oh shit! I'll get yeah. the power wash. I'll no, get the power I'll wash. get it right now. Literally, I'll get it. Oh fuck! Okay, should we take a break then? Yeah, here, hang on. I'm just gonna drop this off. Yeah. Okay, follow me. We're gonna install it over here so that we, so we can do all of our ass blasting in this courtyard here. You happy oh, yeah, with yeah. that? Yeah, yeah. We need some good runoff. Okay, hold up a second. Let me just get the fucking power washer. Okay, I bought it. Oh, and I'm going to place it. You know what? I'm going to place it like here. You see like the little square of grass in the middle of the courtyard? Little square. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see it. I see it. Okay. Look for the power washer there. It should be there now. Look for the power. Is it a, is it a man thing? Like, do I pick it up? You literally just ran over it. <laughs> this is it. No, you just... Le- look, it's right here. Yeah. Oh, you got it. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> Hose me down. I'm ready. Oh, I can't Stead see you holding it. Stead okay, still. I'm ready. Hang on a second. Let me put my hands up. Okay. All right. Get the black heads off. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. I'm getting close. Oh, shit. That's going right up in there. Oh, oh nice. Shit. You're getting I can feel all of the blackheads <laughs> popping and coming oh, off of my shit. ass cheeks. It says oh, this is great. I've already entered. Oh, this is the best. I feel oh. so good. Oh, man. Wow. Oh, thanks. Do you want the front, oh, too? Do a bit of front? Yeah, sure. I got blackheads all over my front. Come on. Oh, the- fuck. Why are you not looking? You're the- Why are you like 10 miles away? I think <laughs> we're like desynced or something. You, what do you mean? I'm right here. Right, okay, you, pal, you, you, you do me now. Okay, you got to go put it back on the machine. I know, okay. I'll hose you down, okay? Oh, nice. Okay, perfect. Oh, man. Okay, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, I'll get oh. the front. Oh, yeah, you're really dirty. Oh. You're so dirty. This, oh, the blackheads are just flying off. Oh, okay, turn around. Let's get that ass now. All right. Uh, there, now you're nice and clean. Oh, oh. This, all this farming work makes us so dirty. Oh, fuck. There. there. Just okay, so now that we're all clean, heads. check this out. Look at how dirty this tractor is right now. You ready? Yeah. Just gonna just gonna hose it down. Just gonna clean it up. Look, it yeah. makes the sound as well. How do you like that? How do you like them apples? Look, see? All the mud's coming off. Oh fuck, it just slowly fades away. Yeah, you like that? That's Look amazing. That. What I, the know, other side? I know, right? Look, the fucking other side too? Sure. It's already oh. done. Holy shit. That that's, is one that's... clean machine, isn't it, bitch? That's some power washing skills right there to do both yeah. sides at the same time. Yeah, I know. Would so you what do you like think? Bounce it? That's fucking amazing. I fucking want to be in this palette now. I want you to take me for it. That's for fucking a, great, isn't it? Midnight cruise. You just, I, you're is, not in it though. Like you're. I think you're desynced or something. Oh. On my screen, you're just jumping in midair. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> Very stiff jumper as well. You'd be an excellent Olympian. Holy shit. Uh, sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep yeah. going. That's Ten, great jumping. Holy shit. Tens all round. Fuck. Yeah, no, yeah, this, yeah. I could eat my dinner off of this. Yeah. All right. Well, Shin, we've done some good work here today. We've yeah, uh, we we've been we've been pretty productive, surprisingly. Do you want to? Um, would you like to power wash this tractor? Because it's pretty dirty too. Oh yeah. Do you want, want me to be to inside just... it while I do it? Sure. That might be scary, actually. Have you no, ever no, been I'm, like... I'm fine with that. I'm going to go into first person mode. Okay, I'm ready. Hose me down. Oh yeah, bitch. Take it. Take it. Do you reckon it's hot or cold? Uh, it's probably pretty cold, I'd say. I don't think it's cleaning it. I'm not even sure what it's hooked up to right now. Now you got to like get close to it, and oh. then give it a really good wash. Oh yeah, get yeah. Get pretty close to it. Just hold the button down and just watch that dirt fade away. Dirt be gone. It's not. I think I must have desynced because it's just not doing it. Really? Yeah, yeah. Where are you? I mean, oh, yeah. you're like ten miles away for some reason. Oh shit! Then. All right, here. Let me do it. Let the All let right. the pro do it. Ready? Okay. You hang up that. Okay. It's hang time up for the this wash. tractor to get an ass blasting. Give it a blast. You're giving it a real blast right now. We're gonna make this. We're gonna make this tractor so fucking clean. Ready for its next use. Oh, this yeah, is that's what I like. Off. That's what I like about a simulator. I like all these little details, you know, because you can really yeah. RP the shit out of it. All the things a tractor can do. Yeah. The cockpit. This is a pretty good tractor, actually. I like the it's train, nice. actually. I want to use that, that winch thing on the train to pick up logs. I think, um, oh, no, uh, for delivering wool, we won't need the train, I don't think. Can we think. not pick up sheep with that thing? Um, is there any train track that goes anywhere near the spinner? No. No, we can't pick up oh. sheep with it either, sadly. So, yeah, we're just going to have to, like, figure out. If we do some logging after sheep, then we can do lots of train stuff to log. That sounds good. That sounds That'd fun. That would be pretty fun. Yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Well, um, we'll be back uh, next time for some more farming sim. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm sure we did. Shin, you like this game? I had a great time. Holy shit. It's a great game. Yeah, me too. I had a really fun time, too. Thanks uh, for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.